we've been trying to restart your systems this January. So get you on track when it comes to food, when it comes to money, also when it comes to your love life. Shannon Boudrim's here. <laughs> important as anything else. I love that we're off the top of the show first, too, because take right care of business top. at home first, right? That is right. Your love life, how you're feeling, your mojo, it is so important. Get the year started right. There may be certain things that you're hanging on to that you need to ditch and certain things that you need to add to your repertoire to maybe get the system going again when it comes to your love life, right? So I want to play a little game of this or that. Okay. And not all this is our bad. You can keep them, but just keep them in the basement underneath a lot of stuff. <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> so we're going to start with ropes. I cannot wait to get this out of my sight. Yeah, a lot of us have robes that look something like, clap if you have this robe at home somewhere. A little Kinda. ratty, a little used, a little very not sexy. I know all. what you're thinking right now, but it has pockets. Yeah, I can put my stuff in there. I can put there. the remote control in there and my <laughs> cell phone and the baby monitor, and no. 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 We're ditching the robe. We're ditching the robe. We okay. want to come out of our bedrooms, out of the shower, getting our, when we have our oils on, just feeling and looking and smelling amazing and putting on something that's still functional and warm and heavy but just makes you feel like a goddess. Oh, that's a little slinky number. Yeah. Okay, let's see this. But the difference is uh, palpable. Tell me about the okay. feel of it. The touch. Oh my gosh, but it feels good on the skin. Because yeah. I know for so many of us, yes. Yes. It feels yeah. good. Yes, honey. It feels good. Yes. I think there are so many of us out there. And, you know, you get home from work and I, you know, whip off my bra like it's poison. I want to take off anything tight. And you just want to put on fabrics that are so soft. Well, you can get both. You can do sexy and soft at the yeah, same time. Yeah, and this right? isn't too inappropriate. Like, if the kids no. come in the room, you're not, like, completely, you know, <laughs> right. feeling disheveled. But it's still just beautiful, graceful. I think it's the perfect piece. And sexy. And it was 40% off. Oh, I love that. <laughs> it's sale time, just people. Saying. Take advantage of those sales. Okay. Next, I want to talk about books, because a lot of us use books to get ourselves in the mood. It's our way of exercising our fantasy, right? right. And so I want you to throw out Fifty Shades of Grey and Danielle Steele and get these books, The Confessions of a Wild Girl and all these tristful, you know, hard pounding filled nights and get yourself some real education. Spend this okay. year actually learning about your body, what works best, and then pass it off to your partner. So I didn't have, this is the book I'm reading right now, which is like kind of not that much fun, but yeah. the Fundamentals of Human Sexuality. Okay. But this book I didn't have, I have it back in California, but she comes first. Ooh. This is the ultimate guide. Every woman should read this, throw these books in the garbage, spend it. It'll take you one day to read it. Um, yeah. It will teach you things about yourself that you didn't know existed, and you'll be very grateful for it. So it's the road of going from fantasy to going from actual physiology. Like, what does it take to make my body work in those ways that I want it to work? That makes a lot of sense. So she comes first. Yeah, you're going to learn a lot more about what works for you and yeah. how amazing and passion-filled and pleasurable your life can be from real books rather than the fantasy kind of garble books. Mm, I love that. Really good advice. Okay, so we've ditched the dingy robe. We're, we've we, ditched yeah. the Fifty Shades. No, what we're else are we that getting out. rid of? Okay, now we're going <laughs> to underwear. Now, when it comes to underwear, <laughs> a lot of us do the, like, kind of sexy. We try, but... Yeah. So I have these ones, which you might be thinking aren't that bad. You might have got them five for fine. 15, and they're okay, but, you know, you kind of had to elbow a 12-year-old out of the way going through the bins. <laughs> like, they're not... So I, I get it, and they're nice, and they're, they're cute, and they're and lacy. Cute. But I want you to get something that has its own section, that's on a hanger. Oh, right. That when All you right. see it... As a matter of fact, this is my gift to you. Oh, I can keep, oh, wow. It just looks. Oh, wow. Like something else. See, this is what my mom would call an eye patch. You just <laughs> that. <laughs> but I'll wear it. But wear it. <laughs> I'll try it. I'll wear it somewhere. It's on the, my body. We've got to hold it up right, because it's the okay. harness. It's the lace. It's the strings. It's like. So is this how it goes? Yes, that's how it wow. goes. Wow. Leo, thanks you. <laughs> Thank you, Shannon. These are awesome. Happy I'll New Year to Happy put Family that right Day. There in my pocket yeah. in my robe. It's a perfect Family Thank Day gift. Thank you very gift. much for that. I, I think your underwear should make you feel like your armor, like your secret yes. armor underneath it. Well, I like the secret part because a lot of your day depends on what you put on your body. It gives you that feeling. And if you feel like you've got this secret arsenal going on underneath your regular sweater and your jeans, it gives you a little bit of hidden power. So I like it. I agree. I'm tempted to ask for your Sid, because you feel very powerful today. I really do. Yeah, I'm wearing my good underwear today. today. So okay. I'm feeling good. Now, last but not least, I want to talk about jewelry. Yes. So when we're having those days where we feel sensual and awesome and strong, we want to make a statement, we yeah. might go to a piece that is loud. 
that sort of says, you know, I'm here and yeah, I'm, I'm out today. Piece. Exactly. It's a statement piece. Um, but I suggest something that's a little bit more mysterious. So a woman's mm. power is in her mystery. So my statement piece that I wear all the time, um, yeah. every time I'm on the show, is this. Okay. And it's just a simple, you know, metallic piece, but it is also a five setting vibrator. <gasps> And I want you guys to hear how powerful that is. And I wear this. <laughs> it's a great conversation starter. Can I feel that again? <laughs> I feel like you're more of a pulse girl. There we go. That might be more you. Where do we get these necklaces? I'm just asking for a friend. Yeah, I, I'm actually doing a special edition of these. So if you go to my website, shannonteresa.com, you can get them that are especially pieced for them. Me. Yeah. And so, so this is, so this is, I mean, is that to use or is that just jewelry? I mean, that's part of the mystery. Oh, it's part of the That's mystery. all part of the mystery. Is it part of the conversation starter right. or is it something that I used five minutes ago? You don't right. know until later when you smell your fingers. It's just how okay, it goes. Okay, I guess I'll be washing my hands after this. <laughs> Listen, that is so cool. That's the sort of thing that you just bring up, you know, when you're on your date with your, with your honey and you say, by the way, this vibrates and everything's taken to the next level.